do have a strange feeling that if I play this game, something's gonna pop out of nowhere and get me. No, I have a strange feeling someone's gonna come out of nowhere and, and, and get me. I'm like, no, dude. Nah, -uh, not today. English language subtitles on. Yeah, can see what he said. He's, uh, keep it right there. Keep it right there. That's better. That's better. So let me see. Are we net? Yeah. Game service is free unlocking based all over the world. Ranking detail. Uh, no. Would you like to recap? For those, recommend for those. I've played it before, but let's watch it anyway because it's part of the uh, stream that I'm doing. I'm going to upload this to YouTube. Okay. Where to start? My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife, who disappeared. I got an email from her. She told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. I found Mia being held captive in a dark basement. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Yeah, she cut your finger. Later on, I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. The people who lived there were already infected. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up hey, family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms with a serum. Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up and saved the both of us. I love the homie Chris. It's not Batman. Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. It's all over now. Village Resident Evil. Well game just came out I pre-ordered this game and you know something I start from the top what's happening motherfucker going to another stream of I was for to say dead by daylight but this isn't dead by daylight this is Resident Evil 8 aka okay, Resident Evil Village I bought this game when it first dropped well I pre-ordered it and I know you guys was wondering like yo Darkness, yo, aka Dream Planoa, aka the Dark Moon Ish World. Whatever you want to just to broadcast this game since you first play like if since you first bought it. Look. I've been through a lot. Alright. There's a lot I've been through a lot. That leads up to it, whatever. I had such a e emotional journey. I've been on an emotional journey, been on an emotional, like, like, mind trip. Had the COVID, I beat the COVID. Well, don't mind me, I, I mind sharing, if you 
want to hear it, you, you're more than welcome to. If you don't want to hear it, you can feel free to skip ahead a little bit further into the video. So I'm going to tell you what happened. Had the COVID, beat the COVID. Returned back to work, got laid off. Got laid off. One of my family, well, relatives passed away. And after that, that happened. Then it was kind of a little bit too much for me. And then after that happened, it's pretty much like just lost control of myself. And I went to go take time for myself. Having to find different jobs here and there or whatever. Well, I'm substituting for different companies or whatever. Plus, I'm, I'm still a shuttle driver, but I'm still substituting like for these other companies until I go back to where I used to work at. So there's that. And at the same time, Sophie. I think you guys are familiar with Sophie. I think she goes by Hanabi. Yeah. She's doing pretty bad. She's pregnant. Her baby died. She had a miscarried. That happened. Um, and my grandma's in the hospital. And I hope she fights this thing. And I hope she gets better. So without me trying to heal from all this stuff, it's pretty much been, it's been, it's been too much. It's been too much. And that's why I'm just like, yo, I, I really can't like do all that stuff. So that's why I've just been trying to take time for myself in order to, you know, like a different outlet. So that's why I haven't been streaming for a while. That's why I haven't been doing, I wasn't myself lately. I wasn't. But on the good news is, if you guys are watching this video, because I'm going to upload this to YouTube, you guys know about the darkness screams and rage and funny moments that I just uploaded to YouTube. Volume 3 is uploaded. If you guys want to see that, don't forget to um, go to my YouTube channel. I think it's Dark Moonish Aura. It used to go by Sonic SSBB7591, but it's Dark Moonish Aura. And yes, there's a new raging video if you guys haven't seen it. It's only been out for like a, like a week. I think like a week so far. So if you want to see it, don't forget to go see it. And with that being said, let's get into some... Resident Evil 8. But I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna tweak my controls though. Aiming speed. I moved that to uh, 4. Uh, that. Nope. Uh, aiming acceleration. Strong mid. Weak. Nah. Change that to mid. Um, Campbell. I said Campbell. Camera wobble. I'm gonna leave that on. Um. Nah, not invert. Invert is really gonna mess me up if I do that. So I'm gonna leave it right there. Normal. Aim assist. No, we don't do aim assists in, in this game thing. Nah, hell no. Nah. We we some beasts. We 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 some beasts. So yeah, we we finna do it that way. No aim assist. There's nothing wrong with people who use aim assist. Like if you can't aim. Then you're a potato. I'm just gonna say that right off the bat. If you can't aim, you're a potato. I should make a post on YouTube. No, make a post on um, Snapchat. So where everyone I'm, where I'm live or whatever. Cause we're in for a, a long way.
Boom. Oh, you guys gotta get me a minute. Jesus Christ. I like how that scarecrow's in the background too. Like that thing's starting to like creep me out a little bit. Okay, made that post. So, yeah, let's start this. Okay, I am ready. No, don't log me out of the dumb thing. What the heck? Hate that. Okay, let's get into it. Let's get into it. So, um, because we are already 21 minutes in. We're late. We're late. We're late. Late for an important date. Yeah, share my data. Can you share my data? Can you share my data? Do I have to go to that homepage? I I'm going to do that later. So, yeah, let's get into it. Bonuses. What's the bonuses? The movies? Remembering Resident Evil 7. Okay, that's a whole summary. So we don't, we already seen that. We already seen that. Don't come in, I'm broadcasting. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Casual. We'll take it easy on you. Standard, just your average difficulty. Hardcore, we'll hit you with all we got. So, even though this is my first playthrough, I would do casual because I'm kind of new to the game, but nah. Me being a legacy player of Resident Evil, I'm going to do this on normal. And when I beat the whole playthrough of it, I'm going to do it on hardcore. And they hit us with all we got at the moment. So, we're going to... We're de we're definitely gonna you know we're gonna be sweating a lot. And it's gonna get it's gonna get get harder. It's gonna get tougher or whatever. But we're gonna see if we can handle it. Um, we're gonna see if we can handle it. Okay, so we're going standard. Doing standard. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence. The bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's oh, worried no. cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, oh, quench Lord. your thirst, he said. 
So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark oh, weaver damn. appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Uh huh. Across waters deep and ominous, she went. Hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron Whoa. steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear the creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift the horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast suddenly a witch appeared dark yet regal Then what happened next? Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She's asleep. What Did she die? The creepy story. She's only six months old. Woman at the store said it was Hey, dark gamer girl. How's it going? <laughs> a local tale. Ugh, how is it going? Seem to mind. Because Yo, T, how's it going? God. Little baby cousin moved what's here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not. Never mind. I swear, if I was married to the girl that I liked or whatever, we had a baby like that, and she was reading scary stories to her or whatever, I'm like, yo, the hell is your problem? I'm just asking, I ain't gonna hit no girl. I'll finish dinner. Jail, bro. Yeah, first playthrough. I mean, I bought this game when it first, like, I pre ordered it, but I've just been busy a uh, lot lately. There you have it, someone does uh, beat Resident Evil 8 for I'll you. Nothing. I'll put her down. That's nice. Um. What the hell does that say? Natural sense. Oh, he, those are huggies. Um, I don't have to. When I when you get older, I'm gonna teach you how to play piano. Oh damn! All right. What's this little Einstein's? No, let let's put little Taluda to bed. That's a Taluda. It's um it's trying can't to support the homie. That flow. VR versus is down sadly. I heard about that. Yeah, I lost uh you contact. You another new book. I lost contact with my uh resident not resident. I lost contact with my PlayStation 4 account. Cause I talked to Eduardo about that earlier. Yeah. At the at the at the um have a drink together. All right. I would love that. I would love to drink with my kids someday if I had one. Um. Our taste in music's definitely improved over the years. You mean mine has? Who asked you? You over there cooking, lady? Yo, T. Yo, thanks for the yo. Thanks for the sub. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Everyone, go follow uh T on T. He's my baby cousin. He also a streamer. But yeah, the reason I haven't been you on hungry? PlayStation 4 in a... No? Maybe later then. Okay, you're going to interrupt me while I'm talking. Um, I lost contact with my... Uh, re uh, I keep saying Resident Hurry Evil. My PlayStation 4 early. account. I if you interrupt me again, I swear. I'm going to 
gonna slap your pancake ass. Um, I haven't been. So your PlayStation Four account is gone. Yes, and no, kind of, sort of. I haven't. Um, Cause it's a long story to be on. Excuse me, it's a long story. Mia makes I haven't been hand, on. So this stuff keeps piling up. I hope it's supposed to be Gerber. Um, I haven't been on the PlayStation 4 for the longest because I keep running into these error codes. It wouldn't let me play my games normally. I tried Overwatch. It wouldn't let me boot. Up, it let me boot up the game, but it won't let me start a match or whatever. Then a blue screen would always say "Up oh, game corrupted." You can't. Um, you gotta restart the application. You gotta delete it and re-download uh, again. I did that. Same thing keeps happening. Same thing keeps happening. Same thing keeps happening. It did it with most of my games. It did it for. I don't like how that door opened. But yeah, it did it with most of my games or whatever. It did it for Overwatch. It did it for Radiant from the Ashes. It did it with Mortal Kombat 11. Cause gamer said she wanted to play more Kombat 11. I booted it up, then it, boom, kicked me out of there. Uh, what else it did it to? It did it to, uh, it did it to my Streets of Rage 4. Cause normally when I started it up, the game would start up, but it wouldn't definitely start up. It was like something wrong with the uh, start up on the menu screen when you push X onto the thing, or whatever. It would play music in the background, but the game would not load. It would not load whatsoever. And then I'm just like, I would be sitting there looking at the damn like thing for like maybe 10 or 15 minutes. And then it'd just be like, you'll see Axel's face with the burning knuckle in his hand. Like, and then I was like, all right. Like it was not, it, it wasn't load. I tried to start Dead by Daylight on the PlayStation 4, but it kept doing the same thing. It did the, the gray tally. I deleted it. I uninstall it, I reinstall it, the same problem kept happening. I try every nook and cranny, I try I try uninstalling it, I try reinstalling it, I try rebuilding the database, I rebuilt the database, I tried everything. I took the PlayStation apart, I cleaned the inside of it, I unplugged the AC cord, that didn't work. I tried my internet for 50 million times, it had nothing to do with my internet. It's perfect and everything, and then I'm just like, I don't know what's going on anymore. I don't know, cause I've been dealing with these error codes for like the past like year or two, and I've been on the PlayStation for like three or four years. I think three or four years. Yeah, cause I know. Yeah, cause I know Dark for like four or five years or whatever. Does your brother have the same problem on his PS4 account? Just asking. Yours, not you. Um. Now he plays on the PC. Yeah, he plays. He's a PC. Uh, he's a PC gamer. Bro, PS4 lightweight canceled you out. Left out. Yeah, it canceled me out. Yeah. And I was like, this is the first time ever I'm always having a problem on the PlayStation 4. I mean, I'm on Xbox currently. I mean, the Xbox doesn't do that. Um, I never have no problem on the Xbox that, that does that. Like, this is the first time ever I'm having a problem like this on the PlayStation 4. I did this constantly. I, I changed the hard drive. I still got the extended hard drive. I did this. I did that. Oh, I, he did have the PlayStation 4 account, but he doesn't play on the PlayStation anymore. He, he that, This is why he got a PC. Yeah, my stepbrother has a PC game. He's a PC gamer now. So that's why he plays on the PC instead of the the PlayStation or whatever. Uh, I tried everything. I tried everything. I looked for answers, did this, did that. So it came down to the point where I, I need to keep looking for answers. Still on my tech uh technical or my shits or whatever. Uh had the flash drive, did this, had to go on the the servers just to download a new up like a new update to the system and everything. This and that or that like I tried everything. Then that 
didn't happen. I tried everything, same problem kept happening. And next you know, I was like, if everything that fails, I had to initialize the PS4. For those who don't know what initialize means, initializing means you're wiping. You have to wipe the PlayStation 4 like clean. Like you hard reboot it. It's like a hard reboot. It gets rid of everything pretty much. If there's no other way another other way for me to get through these like error codes or whatever. No, Nia, I'm broadcasting. Yes. Back next time. Thank you. <sighs> I Jesus. And T says so. What was I talking about? Yeah. I wiped it. When you factor and when you initialize it, you wipe the whole like save data. Um, cause I remember I got my rage clip up, like, I think a week or two weeks ago. No, it was like a week ago on YouTube. Um, yeah, it's, it's a, it's a hard reboot. When you hard reboot your PS4, when you uh, initialize it, you completely wiped it. You wiped all the data, the save the date, save data to your games. You wipe all the pictures, all the um, videos. Yeah, I don't have the vi- I don't have access to the videos anymore. I don't have access to the to the pictures. I don't have access to my games anymore because this is where this is all comes to play. It get it gets a little bit towards the ending. It's towards the ending. Um, I really don't have contact with with anything. And when I initialized the PS4, I was still signed in on the app. And this happened the night yesterday, the night before today. Um, Is this in a message or whatever? I think this happened on a Thursday or a Friday. Because I had to initialize it. I was like, I have to wipe it. There was no other way around for me to solve these error codes. There was no other way for me to solve them. They say if you have to do it, reboot it, hard, like, wipe it. That's your last resort. That's the last thing you can ever do at the moment. So I I took it. It was a little bit of an opportunity for me. So I was like, you know something? I took it. So I talked to Eduardo that night. Uh, my friend Sight, he messaged me and said, um, like, yo, like, what'd you do or whatever? Because I sent a picture in the group chat. I think I sent a picture in the group chat saying um, I made an announcement about it. I have to wipe the PlayStation 4. My storage data was, like, not that huge then compared to the one with my profile on it. Because on my profile, like, my storage data was, like, this huge or whatever. Like, like, I had, like, a tiny bit of free space, but it was like this or whatever. But when I rebooted it, it was like this or whatever. But I have a whole lot of space to fill in with the thing or whatever. So I screenshot it. I posted it in the group. Then I post another picture in there that says there's no games here. Like, there's no games. Like, there's literally no games on the main menu screen. It's just a big blue screen with just apps on it. And that's it. Um, after that, I'm just like, you know, after I rebooted it, I told Corey not to touch. I was like, no one touch that PlayStation 4 until I figure out what the hell is going on or whatever. So I stayed away from the PlayStation 4 for the, for the, for them three days. Cause that next day was Friday, but I had work. So I wasn't able to get onto the PlayStation 4 cause I had things to take care of. Then Saturday and Sunday, I went to go hang out, whatever. I was having a little bit of a midlife crisis. I was I was a mess. I was literally having a breakdown. I was having a breakdown or whatever. Because the stuff that's happening. Because as I said before, I've been on the emotional, uh, emotional trip. I've been on an emotional trip. After that happened, because uh, there was a lot that happened. Ever since me having the COVID, I beat the COVID. Like, I beat the flu. I beat the thing. I got 
I returned to work for a few days. Then I got laid off. And then after I got laid off, my aunt passed away. My aunt passed away. That took, that was a lot harder on me. And then after that, I'm sub- substituting and working for these other jobs or whatever. I'm still with the same company and everything, but I'm not working my original job, but I'm just substituting. I'm substituting and working at these other places or whatever. After that happened, my grandma got real sick. She got real sick, and she's in the hospital. I'm still praying that she gets better and everything. That's why I'm just like, I just need time to to process all this. I need time to pretty much to heal from all this. And and this is where I'm just like, me getting the video uploaded, get this done, get that done. Then I got to run over here and get this done. Then I got to worry about this and worry about, it's like I have a lot on my plate. Like I have a lot on my plate and everything. And me having to deal with the the problem on the PlayStation Four, me having to deal with um, where uh some of my friends on the Xbox One, and me having to um, try and do this, and then the whole Resident Evil Eight thing, and doing this, doing this, and so on. So it 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 was a lot for me to keep juggling. It was a lot for me to keep juggling, and I'm just like yo. Like I, I I need a I need a break. I, I, I was like I needed time to to heal from all of this. It's most of the time like I I went off by myself and trying to see what's going on. It's 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 like me putting piece to a puzzle together. Like all right, this that this and that whatever. But when I don't get a break from like healing and everything, that's why I said everyone just leave me alone for a while. Just leave me alone for a while because I called at Wardo. I called that Wardle that uh that night when I was driving, cause I heard from uh uh Hanabi, aka Sophie. She told me the baddest news ever. Um, she was pregnant, but she had a uh, miscarried, so like the baby died. The baby died in there, but she had a miscarried. So that kind of like messed with my head a little bit, and it messed with her head a little bit, and then it was just like it's, it was it's so much that was going on or whatever, and it just set me right off, like it set me off, and I was like, like literally, like are you, like are you you you're serious? I'm like you're joking. She was like, no, I'm not joking. Like the doctor said, miscarried because she did something. The baby wasn't born or anything. The baby pretty much died. The baby died. And the baby wasn't even born yet. So that was another thing that messed in my head a little bit. And I was saying my, my grandma's in the hospital. I'm hoping she gets better. My aunt passed away. This happened, that happened. It was just like like I lost control of myself and I'm just like I'm driving. And then I called that woman on the phone. I was like, bro, I was like like I don't know what's going on. I'm freaking out. Like I'm freaking out or whatever. I was like like dude, I'm like 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 the fuck. I'm like hey bro, I'm like like I'm like I'm, I'm done with it. Like I was like I'm I'm done with it. I said like, I don't know what to do anymore. I was like I, I was like like I'm like bro. Like I was literally having the worst of it. Having the worst of it. And then the next day, I think two days later, I think it was Mother's Day. So, me cooking, spending time with my mom. I'm going to stream Resident Evil 8 after I get help. Oh, definitely. It's like, did this, did that, or whatever. So, 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 so. Like, broke down for like a while. Is why I haven't been broadcasting. And there. And everyone was like messaging me on Twitter. It's like, how come you haven't been broadcasting? How come you haven't been broadcasting? I was going through a tough time at the moment. And when I first bought Resident Evil 8, when I pre-ordered it, I made a post on Facebook or Twitter saying, yo, I got Resident Evil 8. I'm going to broadcast it when I get home from work. But I had a lot on my plate, and I was just like, nah. Change, change your plans. I'm not going to broadcast it because... Also, I had to deal with the PlayStation 4 or whatever. And then I told everyone I'm not going to deal with that at the moment because I got enough on my plate at the moment. 
But one do not like I'd be doing that off stream left aloud. Oh, definitely. So when that happened, I'm over here like, Lord Jesus, like this is a lot on my in, in my mind or whatever. Uh, made the post, post pictures, this and that. Had a wonderful time yesterday. Made lasagna for the whole family and everything. Did this, did that. Then after that, this all happened today. Because when I was at work, cause I haven't went on the PlayStation app at all today. I haven't been on the PlayStation 4 at all today. I haven't been on the PlayStation app at all today. So, Eduardo calls me as soon as when I got off the, uh, get off work. I woke up at 7. I went to work. I got off work. And then Eduardo, like, calls me. Like, I called him. He sends me a message like, yo, are you going to make another account? I said, make another account? I'm like, what is this dude talking about? So I called him. I was like, yo, what's happening? He was like, dude, you finna make another account? I was like, no, uh, why? Like, what's going on or whatever? He was like, nah, I was just asking. And I was like, um, all right. I was like, I'm still on the verge of getting my old account back. But as I said before, I've been locked out. I got locked out of my account. So I have no... Because you left the group chat, chill. Yeah, because he said something about that. I'll say, I left the group chat? Because we talked about this earlier this this morning, in the not morning, this afternoon. Because I got off work like around like 2.45, but I was never on the app. I was never on the app because on the app, I was locked out of my profile. On the PlayStation 4, I was locked out of my profile. I have no way into getting into my profile unless I got to talk to a like a like an agent or like a administrator so they can let me see if someone hacked you. I don't know if I've been hacked. I don't know what's going on cuz I know you're probably like did someone I'm not sure. I, I don't know if someone hacked me or not. I, I don't even know. That's when, that's when Eduardo told me like this afternoon. He was like, I don't know if someone hacked you or whatever. Cause he said you left the group. I was like, I left the group. He said, Yeah, you left the group. I was like, and When was this? He said, I don't know. It was like around like ten this morning. Like I think it said ten this morning. I was like, I was like, I don't recall leaving a group. I was like, if I left the group, I would have definitely known about it, but. I haven't known anything about it. I didn't know anything about it. And I was like, but it said that I left the group. He said, yes. And then your friend, um, uh, is sassy. Uh, she left the group. I was like, something's probably going on here. I was like, I don't know what's going on. But I was like, I was on my way home from work. But I was still talking to him on the phone or whatever. So when that happened... I'm over here like, um, I'm still talking to him. Then I lost contact with him because the call dropped. And I was like, just, I like, I talked to him whenever I possibly could. I was like, just stay on the phone, stay on the phone, stay on the phone. Get back to the house. Next, you know, I had to leave back out again. Then I sent Eduardo a message saying like, yo, like call me back immediately, dude. Like, I'm still trying to find out what's going on. So, like, if I find out, and then I was like, okay, Edward was probably watching his game or something. I don't know if he was watching his game or nothing, but I lost contact with him because my phone was dying, so I had to recharge my phone, but I had to leave back out. So I left back out at that moment, and I don't know what else happened. And then that's what was like, I'm going to see if I can try and get in contact where, uh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm going to try and get, see if I can get in contact where, uh, with Darken now. And then I was like, there must be a way for me to contact Dark. I was like, Twitch. All right. So I went to Party City. The reason I went to Party City, since I came in with, for the balloons and everything. Yeah, I went to Party City to get her some balloons. Um, I was like, Dark. I sent her a message. I was like, if you see anything suspicious or out of the ordinary or something that you think I would not be doing, don't freak out. If you see anything weird, 
Like, if you see anything weird, let me know, whatever. Um, so did you contact Sony and follow a claim or something? No, I did not do that yet. Because the reason I didn't do that yet, because I got home from work and I was driving around all day and I got exhausted. I got exhausted to the point when I got back home from getting my little sister some balloons and some flowers, I was knocked out. I was, I literally did a lot today. I had to tear down walls. I had to break things with sledgehammers. I had to pick up pallets, wooden pallets, move them onto a truck, then get off. Then I had to uh, unscrew, like, like I'm demolition. It's a demolition job that I'm doing currently at the moment. So it took, it took a lot out of me. So when I got home, I slept. I slept the, almost the whole day. I didn't get back up until, like, around, like, 7 30 or 7 45 then i had to get back up then i had to go pick up my uncle then i had to drive back home got something to eat and ate a little bit talked to winter for a little bit and here i am and then i just started broadcasting and this is where i like the end of the story and this is what i've been up to throughout that whole fiasco i never i had no contact no, no access to my account because I got locked out of it. I got locked out, to, locked out of my account because I went on PlayStation app. Yeah, I went to the PlayStation app. It would not let me go onto the PlayStation app unless I have my email and my password. I don't have my password. I ever since I initialized that the the PlayStation Four, it kicked me off my profile. It locked me out of it. It locked me out of there. So I'm just like, ever since I've been locked out, Eduardo said I left the group or whatever. I'll say, I don't recall leaving the group. And then then that's when I was like, yeah, something's definitely up. I don't know if someone hacked me. I don't know if this happened or that happened. I don't know what's going on. And then that's when they was like, you're going to make a new account. I was like, I might make a new account. But I'm going to try and get my old account back. Because everything on that account, it has everything on it. It has my games on there. It has my DLC that I bought on there. It has it has my videos on there. It has my, uh, it has my pictures on there. Pretty much I have everything on that profile. And if I don't have that profile and I make a new one, I won't have all that stuff I have on my other profile. So that's why I'm like, I got to try and see if I can find a way to get back into my profile. And that's why I'll say, if you said, it says you've been off for three days. Yeah, that's about right. Been off for three days. But other than that, I don't know who's on my profile now. I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's a system thing. I don't really know. That's why I sent the message out. To, yeah, that's why I sent the message out to you uh, earlier, saying if you see anything fishy, or see something that out of the ordinary that I would not be doing, because you know the type of person I am. If you if you see anything fishy or out of the ordinary that I would not be doing, let me know, so I can contact Sony like agents and. You know, administrators or the people who do the modding or, or this and that, or whatever. Like, then I can pretty much tell them what's been going on and everything. So, because I don't know what's been going on, I don't know what's been going on. We say contact Sony as, as as soon as possible to recover your account from what it seems you most likely got hacked. Your PlayStation Network at least did. Yeah, because I don't know what happened. Because, yeah, at one said I left the group. I said, I ain't leave no group. I'm like, what you talking about? I left the group. I said, when was this? He said, this was at 10 in the morning. And I'm like, I said, like, there's no way. No. No. Just those red ones. Yeah, them hot links, those are the only ones. They should be in the bag. No, we should delete it if a hacker on it because I hate hackers. I'm scared. That's the thing about it. 
and I know I came out of nowhere and I sent a message out on Twitter on Twitch and I sent a message out to Eduardo on Messenger I was like don't delete that profile yet unless I'm able to get it back if I can't get it back then I, I don't know and then I might end my uh I might end my uh, journey here with the PlayStation or with Sony. I mean, I don't know what's going on. But I'm just like having to go through all that or whatever in the era codes. I mean, it takes a lot out of me and everything. It, it takes a lot. It takes a lot out. That's a safe bet. And if he can't recover it, he can just add you all back. Yeah. But at the same time, it's just like. It's not me that's doing it. I I mean I I will never leave the group and and and. I just want to know what's been going on, and that pretty much that's all that's just been happening. I don't know what's been happening um after that. I've been trying to get in contact with with everyone for the longest. I should have went this way. Once things warm up, we can go for a walk. Yeah, that's what I'm just saying. Like, I'd even, I'd even told Chris, like, I messaged Christina. They're there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. Yeah, I messaged Christina. Uh, I told her if anything on the profile is like fish or whatever, just let let me know. Let anyone know. Like I'm just like yeah, like I'm still trying to find out what's going on, whatever. Your mom and I love this song so much. So how? Can it be hacked as well? I really don't know. You got me with that. I really have no idea. I don't Almost know. There, honey. I did not turn that door and things just freaking put me the fuck out. Here. I'm gonna put you in your bed. I mean your crib. Yo, some dork hacked my school email and just spam uh, some kind of malware. Yeah, I mean, hackers could do pretty much anything. I mean, they can hack you if you're offline. They can hack you. They, they can hack anything from you, though. They can do all that. Huh? Give me a minute, everyone. I know. Hold on. I know. Stop whining. Stop whining. Stop whining. Let me see. I almost got in trouble with the skull over that. Yeah, I mean, that's what hackers do. Like, hackers, they, they can hack you if you're offline, if you're just doing something totally different. You won't pretty much know nothing about it. You won't know nothing about it. Well, hi there, little Rose. You wouldn't know nothing about it. Cause that's why I'm just like, you know, I said I, I need to find out what's going on. <laughs> it only happens in games if you meet one on Dead by Daylight or any games. But that's the thing though. I don't know what's been going on. Time for bed. I haven't been, I I haven't like been able to, um, yeah, I haven't been able to get onto my account on the PlayStation 4 because, yeah, as I said before, I haven't been on the PlayStation 4 for like a waiting. couple of 
couple she's of scared days. When she's angry. I haven't. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right yeah. downstairs. Daddy won't let those Never fairy tale monsters get you. Yeah, that's why I told that one. I'll say if anything happens, let me know. Like, let me. I was like, let me know if you see anything. I should get rid of it someday. <coughs> Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Everyone's forgotten about this already. Like, let me know if something happens, so like I can report it to Sony. Like all the all the things that have been happening. So I'm over here keeping like a structured note. Did you change your password or email, Darkness? I mean, I, my password, not my password and my email should be the same. But when I try to, like, log in to it, it says that it wouldn't let me log in. It wouldn't let me do that. Hey, keep it down. Just making sure it's locked. Like, I made sure of that. Is she okay? Sleeping like, uh, well, like a baby. Mm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. That might be white, it's too. Chorba de Lagoon. That could probably be it. Local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine, too. But, but at the same time, it's soaking you... all evening. Maybe you shouldn't oh, have no. any. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here. Military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <sighs> Mia, get down! Mia! Clap her ass. Thank you. Thank you. I'm a bad influence. Don't listen to me. Mia. Oh, God. Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! What? Why? Sony and tomorrow. Yeah, I'm gonna try. I, I might con well, I'm gonna contact uh, them when I uh when I get home from work in the afternoon, probably. All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Get your hand off me. <laughs> Thank you. Rose. Get him out of my sight. Can you imagine if I voice get him out of my sight? Can you imagine? Get him out of my sight. Sorry, Ethan. My soldier's fan hit you with the button, but the blah, in your head with the butt of his rifle. Let me stop. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna call Sony when I get when I get home from work tomorrow. Definitely. Hey, Doc. Hey, Doc. No but, uh, yeah, I'm still trying to figure out what's going on now, but I'm keeping track of all the things that that's been happening. Because I want to said I left the group at 10:57, so I'm gonna report that to uh, Sony when I talk to him tomorrow. We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. Keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's going to be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You matter. 
Just Mia, what are, what are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. I don't want to talk to you, Ethan. My boobs are small. I got gumdrop titties. Bye. Watch me storm out that door. Yeah. Um, what did you give Rose back? Eh. No, nah, Chris is like, nah, it's my baby now. Like, dude, like, bro. Like, let me stop. Yeah, I think that was a logical... I still don't think Chris is evil. I, I think he did that for a reason. I mean, out of all the good things that Chris did, I still can't say he's a bad guy. I'm sorry. But we're going to get to the bottom of why he did, fuck. I can still say he's not a bad guy. I'm telling you, in my gut, my gut tells me he's not a bad dude. He's not. He's not a bad dude. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not off the Fuck. What the hell happened to you? Try changing the source. I mean, it's not starting for me, though. Eliminate target, recover the body, secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Move the two Winters Wintersers to site C for further investigations. At least two transport officers to accompany them. See, that there you go right there lets you know what's going on. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Eliminate target, recover body. That, that tells you right there there's something going on here. And it has nothing to do with the, um, with the witch we call it. I can't get in there. No, I don't want to teabag the body. Jesus. But I still don't think Chris is a bad guy. I think it's a logical reason why he did that. He can't be a bad guy. I mean, come on, this is... This is Chris we're talking about. Bro, Mia's gonna get... Bro, Mia again lit up what's the funniest thing ever to me. I was like, there's a logical reason why he did do that. Uh, there's a logical reason why he did do that, but we're gonna find out to the bottom of it. But as I said before, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna diss my my favorite character like that. There's no, there's no way Chris is bad. Nah, he's good. Chris is good, bro. We're talking about the the Chris from the old Resident Evil, the Chris from like the Resident Evil One, uh, Resident Evil uh Revelations, Resident Evil uh Five, Resident Evil Six, Resident Evil Seven, Revelations. Like all this other stuff, there's there's no way Chris can can be a bad guy. There's no way, there's no way, no way. We talking about rock boulder punching Chris with the with the anaconda arms and talking about Captain Redfield, like like dude. If anyone knows how to play as Chris Redfield, it's this guy. I'm telling you. And how'd you cut yourself on that thing? I swear, bro. You didn't have to be the dumbest person ever. I cut myself. Why you touch the thing? You could have just prone. You could have just crouch. The way she ate that first bullet. Yo, it's like when she ate that first bullet. Nah, it, there's another thing about that too. If you was to get shot like in the back of your shoulder, wouldn't you think you would have fell over? Instead of just looking at it like it didn't like bother you or phase you or whatever. Don't you think that's a little bit strange or whatever? Because how people react to a bullet or whatever, they would have been like, 
Like, like literally. And then Mia would have got down, like Ethan said. It's common sense. It's common sense. Fucking. Is that Bigfoot? Yo, I think Bigfoot trying to get me, bro. Did I hear Bigfoot? Like, yo, like, if you don't move out my way. I'm gonna hear that. Like, bro. I don't wanna, like, do. Get out of my face, bro. I can't hear it. What are you doing? Like, dude. Take it back. What the, the heck was that? Oh, I'm over here, like, where am I going? Where am I looking at? I do. Like the Grinch is gonna come out of nowhere and take me to his lair. Like, bro. Come here. Ooh, ooh. Ooga, ooga, ooga. I'm like, that's probably a cave, man. But as I said, for I don't know what I'm gonna do for my whole Sony. Like, uh account and everything but I'm gonna see if I can get to the bottom of it I feel see what I, what I can do though but I'm gonna definitely call them uh, tomorrow when I get home from work or something because I was supposed to be calling them today but a whole bunch of things uh, fell on me and I wasn't able I didn't get a chance to to do that yet The piggy. Not that pig from Saw. Screw that. Can't see shit. You definitely can't see shit in there. Can I close the door behind me? I afraid that like I hate I hate that. I hate leaving doors open right when I enter through a door around. I need to close the shades. Stop that shit. You really gonna brush your teeth in that nasty ass water? Like, dude. Is that door closed? Yo, close that door, bro. Like, Biff has been scratching his back with that brush right there. Like, dude. What else has Bigfoot been doing? It's, what if the Huntress from Dead by Daylight lived here? Like, I swear, she got hairy legs, hairy ankles. That's probably her right now. Um, you're an alcoholic, my girl. That's why you're throwing hatchets at people. Wearing a bunny mask or whatever. Oh, de yep, there go the deer. The ambience really do get you. What the? I swear, I hate it when he does that, whatever. Yo, yo, you, yo. Let me stop. It's actually pretty good. It's good though. I ain't mean to do that. <sighs> it would be a rat. That's a cliche. Let me see. Check the current map for the village for the things that you did. I still don't. What? what the heck is going on, dude? 
can you baby slap me? Baby slap me? Like, literally. I just don't know what's going on. Really? To get out of my way, please. Oh no, why you so chill about it? That rat was too thick. That's, those are one of them New York rats. What did all this? It's one of them New York rats. Them rats you be saying in New York. Yeah, those are some big rats, I'm telling you. I don't care, like, I don't care what you say or whatever, but if you ever go to New York and you see them rats or whatever, those are some big rats, I'm telling you. I'm chill about because I'm like, huh, <laughs> just a normal rat. Look like Chuck E. Cheese or whatever, <laughs> like Chuck E. was in that, in that cabinet. Like, bro. He was definitely in. He was definitely in that uh, classic. Where the hell am I? It's a village. That'd be a great screenshot. Hold on, I'm pretty sure. I don't want to hold the middle button. Screenshot. Thank you. That's what I just want to do. <sighs> I still don't think Chris is evil. I still don't think he's evil. I don't think he's bad. I finna stick with my gun and keep fighting for what I believe in. There's no way he's bad. Poor horse. That's a poor horse. They really did not have to kill that horse like that. They they bogus. Get out of here with that bullshit. I'm not fucking with you. Need some sort of like item. Let's find out. Um So there's a whole other places for me to explore anyway, so I can go in maybe, here. Maybe they're out. This place has been ransacked. Who sliced the pillows? My God, Lee, an easy to pick lock. Where's Jill at? Ooh, tell me y'all saw that. That dude just got dragged. It's like he got violated. Um, that dude got violated. Like this dude was being pulled from the right. I'm like, bro, where you taking that big man? Eh? What did he do to you? If he stepped on your shoe, I, I understand, but you, you don't have to drag a man like that, dude. That dude got guy. That dude got guy, I'm, I'm telling you. Like, that dude got, got dragged off the uh, thing. Nothing in here. Um, definitely ain't nothing in there. Do not enter. Who said I want to enter through there? I don't know who's being on that door either. Am 
I mean, that's how they get you. It's like the, the ambience in this game, like the sound effects, that's how they get you. Can't open that. Like, yo, I ain't see nothing left my mind, you bitch. <laughs> nah, cause that, it's like someone was carrying that dude from around the corner. I'm like, dude. I just want to know where's he taking a big grown man like that? Where's he taking him? When I play Dead by Daylight, that's why I'd be like with the killers, like, yo, what you should happened? put her down. Put him, put him down. Where are you taking her? Which reminds me, back when I was playing Dead by Daylight, I asked that question every time this dude, like, nah, I was playing with my friend Dark this one day. And then this killer picked her up. I was like, where are you taking my friend at? I'm like, where are you taking this girl at? Like? Like can you put her down, please. Like this, like this killer did did not care. She looked dead. She looked at me dead in my eye, and then she just turned around and walked away. I'm like, bro. I'm like, where are you taking my friend? I'm like, can you put her down, please? Killer looked dead at me like this. Shrugs and walks away. I'm like, bro. It's like it's that that time where I was like, I'm a, I'm a <laughs> beat this killer up. Like I'm telling you. I'm gonna put my shake in the freezer. So give me a minute. No, let me pause. I don't want to get jumped by no by no people. So give me a minute. Ain't gonna spook me a little bit but we're, we're just we're just now getting into it we're just now scratching the surface we're just now scratching the surface we're on the tip of the iceberg got some water to cook to calm my nerves so um yeah let me drink some water real quick Let's see. Oh. I thought that was an old lady standing right there in the middle of the uh the witch call it. Stop fucking with me dude. Lock you due to missing homeowner. The fuck was that? I heard someone talking about some. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, let me close the door. Let me close the door. What? Close the door. Don't close me outside. Stupid. Like I'm trying to hide in the thing, not. Bro, I'm telling you, that's the devil. They're opening them doors from far away and everything. I hate that. Don't 
I get a flashlight or something? I'll be a knife. I'll be a first aid. Talk about some shit for. Oh, it's locked. That's why. I was like, why he saying shit for? I'm like, oh god. Did they just run out of the house? Oh. Spoiled soup. That soup is spoiled. Don't don't eat that. Don't eat that soup. Don't eat that. Don't eat that soup. <laughs> See no one out there. Ah, no, no, friendly, friendly. Jesus, wheeze. What the? F Who sent you? Nobody. There was Dude, like, the bro. What's going on? Oh, no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? You have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Take it! Take it! No, it's out there. Who are you shooting at, dude? Are you listening? Hey! Oh, God, he got kidnapped. What the? He got kidnapped. Oh, I'm finna get kidnapped. Oh, God. My new microphone comes in tomorrow, and it's nothing but excitement over here. Ooh! Dead body? Wait, there's more. I have a strange feeling someone's breathing down my neck. I hate that. I hate that feeling. Someone's breathing down my neck or whatever. Um. You alright, my guy? <coughs> Excuse Jesus me. Jesus Christ. Is this where I'm all the people on the, who's I... missing on the milk box go? Oh god. Who is they? Read it over there like I don't see that. Oh god! Girl, I swear, bro. In the chunk of my hand though. What the fuck was that? No. Oh, back. oh, fuck you up. Bitch. Bitch. Can I take my knife out? Get off me, dude. Ah, oh, he bit me. Get off me, dude. This dude could have bite me again. Oh god. I'm saving my bullets. Back. Back. Back, beast. Okay, he could have bite me again. Okay, get off me, dude. Goof true. Okay, dude. Back up. 
Back up. I ain't gonna tell you again, bro. Back up. Get off me, dude. Step off. What the hell? I gotta lower that down a little bit. I gotta get used to that. I'm like, yo, would you back up? I'm like, would you back up, bro? Back up. I'm 100% sure Ethan is tired of things messing with his hands. Yeah, like literally. Leave that dude's hands alone. Is he even dead? <clears throat> now he is. Got 10 bullets left. Fucking jacker. Give me that. My bullet is right there. Boom. Um, crafting. So I can make bullets right there. Make that with that. Got a nerve. It's like Gears of War all over again. It's like Marcus comes out of nowhere. Ah, oh, god damn it, James. Let me stop. I have a strange feeling someone's gonna come out of nowhere and get me. Can the boat cutters. Can I get that dude's shotgun? What that dude shotgun? I'm like, if he's dead, can I have it? Yeah, he bit a chunk of my hand. I hate that. I leave my hands alone. Why can I use the bow colors as weapons and, and whack them upside the head with it? Like, Chuck over here first. I'm over here just looking around and everything. I'm telling you, T, I'm like, dude, I'm telling you. I do want to go in here, but at the same time, I don't. Let me look around first before I go in there. I want to look around first. Okay, it's so not from the other side. Okay, so I have to go in there. off nothing <laughs> that coming from upstairs Got time for you. Thank you. People are crazy. Get 
Yo, yo. That's my window. I'll shoot you into your head again. Off me, dude. Is it over? No, I doubt it. It's not over. Don't don't ever ask if it is it over, cause chances is if someone says it's over. Any survivors out there? Come to my to Louisa's house. Near the fields. Survivors? What are we gonna do? Can I help you? Uh. Creepo? Look, I'm tired of you looking at me. Back out. Hey, get your own. Look, I'm tired of you, dude. Play rough. Okay. Let's play rough. Wanna play rough? Yeah, let's play rough. How you wanna do this? Are uh, you butt much? Back. 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 Back, back. Okay. Okay, dude. I played that long enough. There's no end to them. It's definitely night. Um, let me see. I need scrap. I could build that. Um, use that. Uh, how many bullets? I only got four bullets. What did I just pick up? Ah. And I got some more ammo. Okay, never mind. Getting out of there. Look at you trying to shoot me in the back. Look, dude. Back up, back. Look. Y'all gotta go somewhere. Move. Move.
back up. Climb, 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 climb. Oh, God. Hey, dude. That's my face. Back up, scumbag. <laughs> climb, 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 climb. Get out of my face before I slap you. <laughs> I'm gonna slap that dude. I go back up because I dropped something. Yeah, I dropped some money. I think I got a whole bunch of money from that. But I got two crystals. shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? It's you. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Ugh. Rose, yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? Bell heralds danger. They're coming. <laughs> no. Wait. Where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. They're coming again. 
Rose is here? What a weird woman. You're a weirdo. She is one weird person. So yeah, let's just say that. She's a weird boy. I need to have a lock pick. this way. <laughs> Ceremony site. go through there I take the scrap I think I can sell the scrap to like to a uh, thing to someone or something find another way around. I gotta find another way around. Am I supposed to read these or something? Could be. Hello, have fun. RE8, pretty good game. Yeah, it's a it's a good game so far. You just missed a little bit of like the the stuff that was happening. I'm over here like a werewolf bit my like thing my three. I said three. One, two, three, four, five. I had to count my fingers like a dumbass. Yeah, werewolf or Fox McCloud came out of nowhere, just bit my uh fingers off. I only got three on my uh in my left. If I have on my right, yeah, over here biting my fingers and everything. Like, they bogus. I'm like, dude, can I help you? They do bit my finger. We offer these ghosts of warding to protect the village and its people. Anyone who breaks them shall feel Mother Miranda's wrath. 
But anyway, how's it going, uh, Chanel? If you don't mind me asking. My friend there says, so I have to go over there where the gate is. Typewriters to save your progress. I probably don't need to save my progress yet. I probably don't have to save it yet. Sorry, what was your question? I'm feeding them, so I'm multitasking at the moment. I said, oh, it's, yeah, actually, I, I'll say it's a pretty good game and everything. Like, did you like it in... Like what you think of it? What you think of Resident Evil 8 so far? I'm just now just like at the beginning because I just survived like a like a werewolf attack. I said Star like Star Fox McCloud and, and Star Wolf just came out of nowhere and bit the two fingers on my left. And I don't know why they did that. And I'm like, yo, get back my fingers. And it was actually pretty hilarious. I'm like, yo, get get back my fingers, bro. Stop fucking with me, Lou. You saw that wolf came out of nowhere talking about some. I'm like, bro. Hold up. I'm finna, I'm finna, I swear. I'm not supposed to go there yet, am I? Maybe I am. But, you know something? I got a better idea. Let me try something. I'm finna look around first before I go over there. I love it. I haven't finished it yet. I'm glad you love it. I'm so glad you love it. I swear, like, werewolf come out of nowhere. Ah, I'm like, bro, can I help you? I hear Sigma K. I can go in there and get that K. I'm going the right way? Yeah, I'm going the right way. So that's something about a key around here. No. It's right over here. Is that supposed to be a signal? Was that it? Whatever I just picked out. I don't know what I just picked up though. You can shoot the bags of flour when you when they get close, just stun them for a bit. Okay, I was wondering what the flower is for. I'm like, what's with the flower? Iron Sigma key. I guess I got something there. Mechanical door. I think I gotta go to that. Uh, don't I go to that castle first? Pretty much, I can go anywhere I want. Pretty much. 
Let's try that. You know something? Let's go back the way I came. Let's go this way. No. This way. We're gonna go this way. Life is not so bad though. I tried earlier just in time when they attacked the avoid dodger slash them from behind. Hold up. I probably gotta uh upgrade like Ethan's ability in order for me to uh start dodging easily or something. Buy them bushes. I know y'all in there. No, y'all in them bushes. I don't see you. Right this way. Ah, uh, that mine didn't even work. It's me. I was pushing the RB. I'd block that. Get off me, dude. Jesus Christ. Heads, I'm telling you. Close the door, please. Okay, I was supposed to come in here. Hey, what are you doing here? Stay back, please. Don't hurt us. Whoa, it's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just glad to see normal people at last. Have you seen any other survivors? No. They're all in Louise's house, and she's not answering, and the gate is locked. Quiet girl. He's an outsider. Oh. 
Shit, we're setting ducks in here. Can your old man walk? No. One of the monsters cut him. He's lost a lot of blood. We have to get into Louise's Shh, house. Quiet. Must be a way inside. Stay here. Be quiet. And don't move until I get those gates open. All right. Don't move until I get those gates open. Can I get out in the house? Come on, Papa. Go right this way. Back up. Jesus. Jesus Christ, back up. somewhere I think I'm supposed to go right there that mechanic door or something why it says push the LB button to push him back but whatever but it's like my character doesn't push him back or something I can't even go that way so I probably have to find another way around go through that way I think I'm not supposed to go over there I think I'm supposed to hang around here or something I picked I think no go back over there then cut your way and make your way over there okay I'm gonna try that 
I mean, you do get confused a little bit where you're supposed to be going, but you'll figure it out. This way or that way or something. Church, something about the well. Something about the well and everything. Locked. Signet key. Looks like I went through here. It's a little confusing now. Um, let me check. try somewhere because I'm in this area right here though I gotta find a way to get that get those gates open or probably I'm looking for a bucket am I supposed to look for a bucket Need some sort of item. Okay, so there should be an item that I'm looking for over there. I'll try to figure it out. I figure it out. I not jump over the wall? Can I not do this and do that or whatever? I find my way. It's probably gonna be like that same time back on uh Resident Evil 7 where it's gonna take me a while to figure out where I'm going. But yeah, it's gonna take a while. It's gonna definitely gonna take a while. Bear with me on it. I find my way. I find my way. Go this way. Let's try this way. It's always a bucket that they need. It's always a bucket. Need some kind of item. Yeah, you definitely need some sort of item. That's what I'm looking. Uh, that's a lot. Looks like 
because I don't have any other things though. Let me check. Take your time. Yeah, it's gonna take me a while, but let me look. Let me look what we got here. I got the maiden crest, and that's the only thing I got. Yeah, just the maiden. Maiden crest. So let me check here again. No. Probably goes to that door over there. But I can't go through there anymore. Yeah, I can't go through there. Cause the old lady locked the gate right behind her. Yeah, the old lady locked the gate right behind her. I can't go there. That's locked, so I can't go through there. Um, I can't go through here because that's locked. So um, the only thing I can just do is just go this way. Or look for that bucket. I think the bucket's the only thing I can, uh, I can get. I can find out or whatever. And I gotta find the other one. Guess this leads to the castle. Nah, cause I can't go through there yet. I definitely can't go through there. I just want to know who this lady is. Yeah, in case you get the I yeah, I'm not gonna use that. No, I'm not gonna use the, the save thing. I'm not gonna save that just yet. I need a uh need to open that. that so it should be somewhere around here that I'm missing something around here that I'm missing I know I'm getting warmer Nope. I don't think there's nothing in here. Nope, ain't nothing in there. It's definitely ain't nothing in there. Let's check in here. Nope. Nothing in there. So let's check somewhere else. Ethan, you're over here hitting a whole bunch of stuff. You're hitting a whole bunch of things, Ethan. Jesus. No, it has something to do with a bucket. Find a way to the castle. Find shelter for... Yeah. Hold up a second. There's no bucket around here. Is there supposed to be a bucket around here that's supposed to be looking for or something? That's my only guess. I'm looking for a bucket. 
Cause I went through Outer Gate. Yeah, I can't go through the Outer Gate yet. Cause I just put a Witch McCullough in there. So it must be somewhere like around here or something. If I'm missing something. Yeah, you tend to get stuck a little bit. Am I supposed to be looking for a bucket? <laughs> like that's the that's the thing I'm looking. At. Am I supposed to be looking for a bucket or something? Cause I can't go through there yet. And I know the, all these wells are over here saying that I need something. So I think I'm. My guess is I'm looking for a bucket. I think I'm supposed to be looking for one. Can I not get the door open? Can I not kick the door open? I know I can't get through here. Uh, nah, can't get through there. No. Let's check. Uh, let's check in this house over here. Probably nothing over here, but I mean, it wouldn't hurt to check. So yeah, let's check. Let's look. Oh, there's nothing in here that I can use. Oh, there's nothing in here I can. I can use. I can't go through here. I can't go through there. No bucket left out. I kind of figured. I kind of figured I'm not supposed to be looking for a bucket. I'm supposed to get something from her or something. Am I supposed to touch her heel? Cause that didn't work. Probably not her tail, but um, am I supposed to shoot the thing off her hand or something? Nah. No, I don't. Yeah, I don't think I'm supposed to do that. Yeah, I am the very odd about that statue right there. Let me go back the way I came again. You'll find your way, dude. You'll find your way. You'll figure it out. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna need that herb. I was definitely gonna need that herb, though. I must be getting warmer, though. I know I'm getting warmer. Uh, I can't go up there just yet. Right? No? Nah, I'm um, not supposed to go up here yet. Nah, I can't go in here yet. Can't use a family photo on the gate. Uh, let me look around. Find a way to unlock the gate and follow. I knew I was in the right spot. I knew I was in the right spot. But how am I supposed to... Am I supposed, nah, I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna hit that yet. Wait a sec. I know it has something to do with this little wagon right here. Is that something to do with this wagon? Or the little gate right here? I know there's something for me to climb on. It has to be something that I can climb on though. I already went through the back. Yeah, I already went through the back. I kind of fit. Hold that thought. 
Hold that thought. <laughs> I kind of figured. Give me a minute. <laughs> Give me a minute. This now. <laughs> so you mean to tell me I've been over there instead of just looking around for a bucket that I'm not supposed to be looking for there was literally a thing that I could have climbed on and if I look to the right there was a little thing that I could climb over. I swear. Can kiss my ass. Kiss my left skin caramel ass cheek. Come on, it's clear. To relying on other people. I'm sorry. <coughs> Excuse we'll me. We'll be safe in here, won't we? Safer here than out there, that's for sure. Hey, do you know anything about what's going on around here? It doesn't make any sense. Mother Miranda has always protected us. Nobody's answer. Father? <laughs> we have to get inside. We're getting so. Just hold on a bit longer, Papa. Uh, uh, let me look around first. I am so sorry, people. There's so much. Hello? Anybody home? Maybe a familiar voice. Louisa! Open up! It's me, Elena! It's me, Elena! Stop shouting. You'll draw the monsters. Julian, calm down. If you'll put that afraid. gun down. Stay back. <laughs> Father, for God's sake, Julian, let us in. No, no, they'll smell the blood. You'll endanger us all. My father will die out here. But that's not my problem. What's going on? These people want to let that a gun man down, dude. Home. Come now. Jesus people Christ. are our friends. Go on, go inside. Come now. This way. You're not from this. Get that gun out of my face before I uh, slice your face up. No. I'm Ethan. Yulian, go make yourself useful and check the grounds. I said go! I said go! Well, if Elena trusts you, then so do I. She said go, sir, go check the grounds. Why are you standing on the left side of the door? An idiot. Wait here. I swear, don't you hear the way people do that? 
don't go check the grounds, but do want to like stay right there and, and and just look at you. Like, dude, go do your job, bro. Don't you hate it when people do that? Yo, go check the grounds. I said go, then they don't actually go check the grounds or whatever. They went somewhere totally different. I'm like, wow. Some butt munches. Come inside, the others are waiting. fuck is this? Outsiders, you're gonna get us all killed! Right, Anton. He helped Leonardo and Elena. We were doing fine by ourselves. Please, Ethan, take a seat. Is this all that's left? From your entire village? All that's left? All that's left? There is no one left! A worthless invalid? A stupid, wailing bitch! And you! You drag a bloody man and an outsider in here like it's nothing? And expect to be all safe? There is no safe! Every sorry bastard out there has been ripped in half. But tomorrow? Tomorrow we'll all be dead. Just like her damn husband. <laughs> Put a sock in it, Roxana! That's enough! This house has a way family for generations and drunk or not you are all welcome and safe in here Dude, you didn't put that liquor away Can someone Probably take that liquor what bottle the and hell is going on here? We don't know One day we were a quiet devout yeah, sit your ways and the now, next Pilgrim. the monsters came and attacked us And they they kept coming wait Louisa and, where is your husband? Did they? No. N no, he, he is out there. Somewhere. He, he went to get help. Yes, yes, that's... That's it. He, he went to fetch help. Let us pray. For him. For all of us. Good idea. Come. Gather. Great ones, hear our voice. Together as one in reverence, we call on thee within the endless dark to deliver us into fate's hands. As the midnight moon rises on black wings, so we make our sacrifice and await the light at the end. In life and in death, we give you glory. Mother Miranda. Amen. No. Let me stop. The tea should be ready. I said amen, not Xbox. Come help me, Elena, please. That prayer. I've heard it before. There was an old woman near the graveyard. You mean that? <laughs> Some bitch is crazy as a bag of rats. There is wisdom in her devotion, though. And I hope it protected her, as it shall protect us. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Leonardo, what's wrong? Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, Lord. Elena, no, stay back. No, let me go. Shoot him again. Lena? 
I said no! Stop. Hey, hey, that wasn't your father anymore. You did the right thing. How is she still alive? Helena, no. There's nothing you can do. Papa! This entire place is collapsing. No. You couldn't save him. He was already gone. Leave me alone. No, we're getting out of here. Together. I gotta get out of here. Hey, Jesus Christ. People are crazy. Know how she feels. It's all right. It's going to be fine. We could just get through this wall. The fire's moving fast. What are you thinking? Step back. We can bust out with this. Let me back up again. The fire. There isn't any time. <laughs> Nowhere to go but up. <laughs> Grab on. Hurry. <laughs> Let's move. Don't worry. And try not to breathe in the smoke. I know. Thank you, Ethan. <coughs> you're kind. I hope your family is safe. I do too. Once we get out of here, maybe you'll get to meet them. <coughs> Come on, it'll hold. <coughs> there, that's our way out. Oh, thank God. But what then? The village is still full of monsters. We can't fight them, there's too many. Hey, hey, don't talk like that. We'll find a safe house to put you in until I can find my daughter. My hunch is she's in that old castle. No, that place is full of nothing but blood and death. And I don't want to be alone while you're... Father? Don't Elena, do that. No. 
That's not him. Not anymore. He said my name. Father! Wait, it's not safe. I swear, why would you go down there? Stay there. Come on. Give me your hand. Ethan, go. Save your daughter. Elena, don't give up. Reach for me. Damn it. I swear, why do people gotta be so stupid? Why is everyone dying on me? This is, this is just too much. Why she gotta be such an idiot, like, dude? Like, if you know that's not your father anymore and, she, and he's, like, infected or doing this and that or whatever, why would you still, like... I swear... I don't get people. This place is going Be right bad. back. Okay, gamer. Uh, Why the fuck is this happening know. again? Oh, shit. them all. <laughs> oh heck. What's her problem? That's why she ain't old bad. problem is now, I'm not gonna sit there and find out I don't know what's wrong with her this this that new game dark yeah it is no it's a uh, Resident Evil uh, village
Resident Evil 8. If versus do come out, I mean, versus is out, but the servers are down at the moment. left you must be pretty tough huh who the fuck are you yep oh you're not local even better what the heck mother miranda is gonna love you <laughs> I swear, dude. Wait, you're whining. We're almost there. Shut up. <laughs> the man is of no real use to anyone else. And my daughters do so love entertaining foreigners. Furthermore, I can assure you to entrust the mortal to house still just. My daughters and I will live with her. Get out of the way! Uh, uh, I want to see! You mean, <laughs> He's away! You mean, Don't you shut the fuck up! What? Where? You mean you'll screw around with him in private, and where's the fun in that? Give him to me. And I'll put on a show that everybody can enjoy. Oh, so gauche. What do we care for bread and circuses? The man thing's suffering is assured. Yeah, gag, yeah, because the man's dick is cut off in the castle. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I've heard all your arguments. Some of you were less persuasive than others, but I've made my decision. Heisenberg, the man's fate is in your hands. Mother Miranda, I must protest. Heisenberg is but a child, and his devotion to you is questionable. Give the mortal to me, and I will ensure he is ready. Shut your damn hole! And don't be a sore loser! You'll find your food somewhere else. Quiet now, child. Adults are talking. I'm the child. You're the one who's arguing with Miranda's decision. You wouldn't know responsibility if it was welded oh, to Oh, keep growing! One day your head might actually fit your ego! Fight, 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 hey, don't fight, I get a fight, say in this? Silence! <laughs> My decision is final. There will be no argument. Remember from whence you came. Thank you. Ha. Lycans and gentlemen, we thank you for waiting. Why she got and a big let bite? The games begin. I don't like this game. Let's see what you're doing. Ethan. Get ready. That's my face, bro. No way! Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Jump it for it. Two. Jesus Christ! Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Run for your life. <gasps> Very nice, Ethan. <laughs> Glory, Jesus Christ. Can I help you? No. Oh, 
shit. Jesus Christ. I think I'm supposed to flinch at that part. I think I'm supposed to be flinch. I think I'm supposed to flinch at that part. I have my guard up. Ah, Jesus Christ! That's right. Run for your life. Ah. Yeah. Very nice, you <laughs> Yeah, I can skip that part. I already know what happened. Shit! Go under, dude. Jesus. <laughs> My word. You truly are as strong as they say. Oh, you don't think I'd let you get away. Gotta keep Donna and Moreau entertained. So now it's time for the beautiful, blood-soaked grand finale. <laughs> Fucking shit. Okay, I need to know what the hell I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, I get it. Let me see if I can go, see if I can jump right back up the thing. I fancy if I can do that. I fancy if I can jump right back. Ah, Jesus Christ! That's right. Run for your life. I jump on the witch, we call it. Very nice, <laughs> Okay, I know what you're gonna do. Shit! <laughs> My word. You truly are as strong as they say. <laughs> oh. Think I'd let you get away. Oh, uh, not right here. Gotta keep Donna and Moreau entertained. So now it's time for the beautiful, blood soaked grand finale. Ha ha ha! Something like Prince of Beef! Ha 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 ha! Too close. Wait, do those freaks have Rose? Escape the mines. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I've been here before. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to. 
to go out. I can't go out. I guess I gotta pull that lever. I've been waiting for you, Mr. Winters. How do you know my name? Anyone, Whoa, who has, anyone has heard of the likes of you. A hero searching for his daughter. Though I must say, that castle arouses suspicion. Yeah, and so do you. <laughs> I am but a humble merchant. Here? Oh, forgive my manners. Call me the Duke. Now to business. Weapons, ammunition, healing salves, anything you desire, I can provide. Well then, feel free to peruse. Good day then. Shall I choose something for you? Please do take a look at my new stock. Shotgun ammo. Recipe for shotgun ammo. Thank you for your purchase. Come now. I'm a merchant after all. To think I would buy such things. What are you buying? <laughs> Just something an old friend of mine used to say. <laughs> what are you buying? What are you selling? I miss that dude. Apologies, but I don't extend credit. Hard times, Ethan. A good deal, if I say so myself.
Could Rose be here? Three daughters. Bella Cassandra and Daniela. I can't go in there just yet. Hold on a second. It is 12.33? Okay. I'm gonna play a little bit longer before I end it. So, let me keep playing. How you doing, Way? How's it going, Way? You really want to hit my blood? I mean, hit my leg. You like, get off my leg, bro. Where are you taking me? I don't like that. I want to hit my Mother? leg. I bring you fresh prey. You are so kind to me, daughters. <laughs> ah, now, let's take a look at him. Wow, wow, like Ethan that. Winters. You escaped my little brother's idiot games, did you? Let's you see how like special that? you are. <laughs> yes, mother. I like that. What you guys doing with me? I don't like that. Oh. Hmm. Starting to go a little stale. Then let's devour his man flesh quickly, Mother. But I am the one who captured him. Now, now, daughters. First, I must inform Mother Miranda. But later, well, there will be enough for everyone. <laughs> Udama. I like that. Hey, <laughs> Oh, be careful what you wish for, Ethan Winters. <laughs> I swear, I'm gonna drop kick you in the face. It's like dead by daylight all over again. What are you doing? Don't wave at me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
I don't like that at all. Crazy bitches. Crazy <laughs> is all hell. Goddamn cop. Cause you're crazy. Well, that's some man blood and all that type of shit. I don't like that. Man blood. You gonna stab my leg, you gonna bring me to your mom's room. I don't like that. See if it comes to that like that or whatever, this is why I'm gonna set an example. Maiden of the Harvest. Maiden of the Harvest. All right. They taken Rose. We meet again. Duke, why are you here? Where there's coin to be made. <clears throat> and have you found your daughter? No. If she is truly here, the lady of the castle would have kept little Rose in her private chambers, would she not? Dominic The very same. Why don't you take a look? 
Maybe you'll get lucky. And speaking of looking, care to make a purchase? Uh, maybe later. Um, but anyway, guys. the stream right here I put up I think it hold up yeah I'm in the stream right here I think I put up like as long as this like this uh first playthrough can actually be out I got stuck at some parts but we found a way I've been streaming for three hours and six minutes and 52 seconds look I gotta go to bed Cause I got work in the morning. When I get home from work, I would probably play more of this. Thank you guys for coming in here. It really means a lot. If you like what you see, don't forget to hit that follow button. Like, comment, subscribe. Cause this is going on YouTube. That's why I said that. If you guys like what you see, I would do more of this tomorrow. Thank you, Dark Gamer Girl, for coming in here earlier. Gamer, aka Chanel. AKA Tay on Tay, thanks for the subscribes. I really appreciate it. Thank you guys for coming in here, it really means a lot. Uh, dream travelers travel together. Uh, remember that, and I will catch you guys later. In uh, deuces, everybody. And we'll probably play more Resident Evil Village, AKA 8. We made it in the castle. Now we just got to find our dark daughter, and we got to find out if Chris is really bad or not. And I'm still going to stick to my theory that he's not bad. He's not. That's all I can just say. So, I will catch you guys.